I'm guessing you're watching this because you want a well-respected cybersecurity degree. You don't want to spend fifty, sixty, seventy thousand dollars trying to achieve this along with four years of your life, not including opportunity cost of lost salary. In this video, I'm going to go step by step on the WGU bachelor's degree in cybersecurity and do a full walkthrough. I'll also be going over this little known resource that will speed up your progress by years and also save you over $25,000. Stay to the end and I'll go over step by step on how you can utilize that. If you are new to my channel, I'm Nicole. I currently work within the cybersecurity field and I got my master's degree from WGU four years ago within cybersecurity. I also have my bachelor's degree. And I got that at a brick and mortar school. There are a lot of pros and cons to each one of these. I'm assuming you really don't want to go back and sit in that brick and mortar school and you don't have, number one, the time to do that, number two, the funds to pay the outrageously high tuition. And you are stuck in a classroom a large portion of the time and a lot of those classes aren't going to be hands-on. The WGU bachelor's degree is fully accredited and NSA recognizes the curriculum as saying, yes, it's good to go. The second really big benefit of WGU is you can do as many classes as you want during that six month term. Something that you can utilize to even speed up more of your progress is this little known resource called study.com. This is really nice because a lot of the general education requirements you can actually just knock out with study.com so you don't have to sit through those really dreadful presentations. They have both upper and lower level division courses. I suggest starting out with their starter plan and knocking out all of those lower division courses and then upgrading and knocking out those upper level division courses. And these are, again, 100% online, and you can go as you please. They also got rid of the quizzes aspect of this, so there's not a lot of busy work while going through these courses. We all know that people just go and then probably put that into chat GPT to help them answer these quizzes in a way. It's really good for knocking out your math classes, your compositional classes, your science classes, you also will get 10% off this college starter plan if you use that link below in the description. If you complete all of their, those courses that they have, the college algebra, the critical thinking, the composition, then you'll already enter your WGU bachelor's degree within cybersecurity with 50 to 60 credits already starting out because you'll be going through a lot of these classes, you'll be studying for those certifications that WGU gives you vouchers for to help you speed up the process even more. If you really do a one-to-one -one analysis of the price of how much a traditional school costs compared to how much study.com and WGU can save, it's way over $25,000. A traditional school will cost you about $10,000 in tuition per year alone, along with four to 5,000 random fees, along with the books that you have to buy. What exactly would I do if I were starting out today? The first thing that I would do today would be to start with study.com with my 10% link below. And I'm really pushing this because number one, I think it's a really great deal that you can knock out these really boring classes that you don't particularly want to do and save yourself a ton of money, but also it creates momentum. There's a thing called escape velocity, and it takes a lot of energy to get out from where you are. A lot of people will watch this and they'll be like, oh, I'll sign up for WGU tomorrow or the next day or something like that, or maybe next month. And years will go by and they'll send me a message asking me again how to get into cybersecurity. And they haven't really started to do anything and they're just watching tons of YouTube videos. You need to get out of that escape velocity. And the best way to do it is if you sign up or something today, either go and enroll in WGU or you can sign up study.com and start getting those foundational classes knocked out. And then in the next two to three months, I would do as many of those courses that I could possibly do and then really start psyching myself up to get into this degree program at WGU in cybersecurity and either get your bachelor's degree or your master's degree within cybersecurity. Now, once you have a solid chunk of these done, then you can transfer these into WGU. You'll have a really good head start here, not only in the course curriculum, but also the actual knowledge you need 
to pass a lot of those certifications included with WGU. And then once I did that, I would enroll within WGU for my cybersecurity degree. And then I, I would just try to go through a WGU bachelor's degree as quickly as possible and dedicate a lot of time into it and really getting the best out of it and really completing that coursework. Now, while doing this, just remember, I would also do hands-on projects, which I do have a lot of videos on that, but create cybersecurity projects that go along with your WGU curriculum. And you want to do this because it really gives you context for what you're learning it's really hard to grasp everything without context, even though it's more frustrating. It will actually speed up your progress. You have an actual tangible credentials that employers see and recognize, and you also have access to a lot of alumni. Don't let the years pass by and then be one of those people who sends me an email and have been watching my videos for three, four, five years, still wanting to get into cybersecurity, but haven't made any progress. That's a scary place to be. In five years from now, you could 100% have a bachelor's or master's degree within cybersecurity, and you could be working within the field. Now, it's not going to happen if you don't take action today and gain that escape velocity and momentum you need to get out from your current position. Sign up below for 10% off with study.com. Now I'm going to go over a brief overview of study.com so you can get a feel for it before you sign up. If we go to study.com, I'm going to give a brief overview. Here is what the website looks like. So we have a lot of the courses. So it's a really easy interface. And as you can see on Trustpilot, they have 2,800 really good reviews. It's actually really hard to get 2,800 positive reviews on there. So that's really great. Trustpilot tends to not be so kind. Basically, you would just go here and then you would have your self-paced course completely online, completely at your own pace. And then you would just click here and then the lessons are really short. So it's not going to be like four to five hours long for a lesson. So you can just do this in your lunch breaks. You don't have tons of quizzes that you have to take. They're also no longer proctored. Really easy interface and all of that. Hello, I'm editing Nicole here. So it's important to also realize that study.com has two different uh, plans. And I suggest starting with the college starter plan. And that's because number one, it's cheaper monthly and you can knock out all of these really basic lower education classes. And then once you have completed these, then you're going to want to do some upper level classes, which then you can transfer to Western Governors University. That will be the College Saver Edition, which is a little bit more expensive than the starter one, but includes a lot more classes. And so it'll be able to speed up um, your WGU progress and save you a lot more time in the long run. I suggest starting out with the, the starter plan, which you can get started for with all of these classes today in the link below in the description for a really affordable price. And as you can see here, if you go to the study.com Western Governors University, you can search all of the courses that you can clock out of and get, you can actually achieve before you even start your degree. With that starter plan below, which you can save 10% if you sign up today, you can get all of these just knocked out way before you even start your degree. If you just take a few of these even, like four classes, then you're actually saving yourself $4,000. So they have this really cool feature right here which you can see. So if you were to take all of these, you would actually save about $18,000 and you would have 52 credit hours that would transfer to WGU and you can get your degree at maximum two years. So it's really cool how they do this. I wish this was here so I hadn't wasted four years of my life in a brick and mortar school and then also get thousands of dollars of debt. I highly recommend the Western Governors University bachelor's degree in cybersecurity and also the master's degree at WGU in cybersecurity. They're both really good. And then I strongly recommend signing up for study.com today to gain that momentum and save yourself $18,000 
and 52 credit hours. Come back in a year and tell me that you signed up for WGU and that you're making a lot of great progress on it. I'll talk to you when you send me that message saying that you have been going through WGU. All right, bye.